Over at East Mecklenburg High School, the Eagles really think they're ready to make a big run in the state 4A playoffs. Their star running back, Kamal Howard, who you see here against Barry High School last week, had a big night, 32 carries, 250 yards, and four touchdowns. One of the top five uh, performances in school history in a single game for a running back. Howard's being recruited by some ACC schools like Wake Forest. He's also getting a lot of attention from Charlotte. And he's the reigning Southwestern 4A Conference Player of the Year offensively, an award he won as a sophomore, which is a very big rarity for a conference to produce 19 4A or 4AA North Carolina Western Regional Championship teams. Here's Howard. So what did you do in the offseason to get ready? I worked hard offseason, even when we had blackout weeks. Mm -hmm. I go outside and do whatever I could do. What's whatever I could do? I'll do on a ladder, cones, whatever, jelly, all that type of stuff. Yeah. And kind of, what, are you seeing the benefits of that right now? Oh, yeah, speed and that came up a lot. Yeah. Exactly, I run routes better. How are you going to deal with everybody gunner for you? I, mean, I know you had the first good game last week, but they're going to really come after you now. We'll see. The Eagles have made a lot of progress in the past two years. They were 2-9 and nine in Coach Schufer's first year. They were 6-6 six and six a year ago, and this year they're 1-0 and oh already off to a change in the work ethic. When I first came here, a lot of kids like to sit under these shade trees <laughs> and not practice or go see the trainer, and we, we don't have much of that anymore. We, we run crisp practice, get through it, and they get their work done. It's been a real real fun time for us. Is this as much fun as you've had in It year? is. It really is. I, you know, if you go back and look at Butler, when we started Butler, that was a fun time and taking that group under the radar to, mm -hmm. you know, the first time we made the playoffs and winning 10 that third year. Mm -hmm. um, I, I could see it very similar. When Schufer arrived on campus, he started seven freshmen and he took his lumps. Again, they went two and nine, but he knew that down the road this team was going to be special. And right now, they have 17 starters back, including those seven freshmen who are now all season juniors. And junior quarterback Khalil, uh, Gilly, Khalil Gilliam, rather, who was one of the key figure stones that seven freshman team really thinks East Mech's future is very, very, very bright. Yes, sir. It's just a lot of hard work. Nobody really sees it. Everybody still thinks that right? we're like you know, the East Mech that 2010 East Mech. But it's not. It's just a lot of hard work. Everybody dedicated now. So, What's been the difference you've seen in your first two years over here, Coach? Well, my first year, you know, he was kind of. Like he wasn't really on us on it how he is now. Mm -hmm. But it's just more hard work. He's just been working real hard in the weight room, on the field. People just saying after practice, he a little extra work. Just, just so you're starting to see, they're starting to enjoy that win and want to get more. Yes, sir. So what's that going to do for you guys this year? You know, hopefully take a deep in the playoffs and give us a chance to stay. That's what I'm hoping for.